The busy summer travel season is fast approaching and more and more women are traveling alone. But is traveling solo a good idea and could it be dangerous? Here are important tips on how to stay safe. Andrea Weatherly, a 38 year old hairdresser, is doing something that can be daunting. She's traveling alone. I'm kind of new at the solo travel. Nearly 72% of females travel solo, but more than ever, they have reason to be extra careful. Just last month, an American woman on safari by herself in Uganda was kidnapped and held for ransom. She was later released. And last December, this 36 year old Florida woman traveling alone in Costa Rica was found stabbed to death in her Airbnb. So on her solo trip to Hawaii, Andrea isn't taking any chances. If I am on the first floor, I always make sure that my window locks. And another thing I always like to do is make sure that the door has a proper lock and that it works properly and makes me feel secure. Another tip, use GPS apps on your smartphone, like Life360, that can tell loved ones back home exactly where you are at all times. Basically what it is is a tracking app so you can join your family circle and you can see where they are and they can say where you are. So I've set it up so everybody can watch me while I'm here in Hawaii. You guys ready to go surfing? Yeah! Today, Andrea is heading out on a surfing adventure in Hawaii with eight other solo women travelers that she just met. For these women traveling alone, there's definitely safety in numbers. It's important to travel cautiously but not with fear. Kelly Lewis, founder of the women's tour group Damesley.com, gave us some tips on how to stay safe. Make sure that you're aware of your surroundings. You're seeing who's near you, who's looking at you, where your things are, where you're going. Like, you have to be present in what you're doing as you're doing it. Another tip, bring a door stopper with you like this one. Since most doors open inwards, by putting it under the door, there is no way for someone to get in. Kelly says in these dangerous times, women should not give up traveling, but they should be extra vigilant. I think you do have to exercise a certain amount of caution wherever you're going. Our expert also recommends waiting before posting your whereabouts on social media so would-be predators cannot find out your exact location.